Welcome to NPR News. I'm Jeff Spiegelman. The story that we're working on on the top of the hour, kittens and why they smell like bacon and the vets that make them that way. But one of the top stories coming out of Asheville right now, super genetically enhanced intelligent monkeys have broken out of their research cages at Origamic <laughs> Research Institute. On with the other news of the day, brownies and why you shouldn't eat them because of your fat, fat... Whoa. Terry. What? What's going on in there? Who's manning the sound booth? Oh, oh my God. Oh, my God. No. You guys stay back. What are, what are you doing? You have... You have knives? My God, you are super intelligent monkey. Look. Oh. Oh, God. Oh, there. We'd like to pause here for just a moment to remind you that this is our fall fun drive here at the station. If you value quality programming such as Wait, Wait, Don't Tell Me, Car Talk, Prairie Home Companion, and in-depth investigative reporting on government corruption and monkey apocalypse, consider making a pledge today. And now back to the station where Jeff will give us an update on the situation. How are things looking? <laughs> Hello, this is Jeff Spiegelman. And I've now locked myself in the janitor's supply closet. I just want to say, if I don't make it out of here alive, I love my kids. Oh, God. I love my mistress. And to my wife, I hope you rot burn in hell, you filthy, filthy whore. God, I hate you. This is NPR News.